What's going on, everybody? Back again with another reaction video. Today, I'm reacting to Dana White and his savage demons. Uh, I would imagine he's going to be yelling at reporters a lot in this video. I'll leave the original video in the description below. Let's get into it. What's his name tonight? That idiot's name that I can't stand. Darren Vell tweets out, the fuck does Darren Rebell know about <laughs> fighting number one? Okay, let's let's start with that. And he says uh, the UFC got destroyed tonight because Chris Cyborg lost and Amanda Nunez won, and she's not marketable at all. And fucking, he was heated. I heard that Dana White was heated when Cyborg lost Does to anybody uh, Amanda here disagree Nunez. With me, the Masagati is a fucking yeah. toolbox. Yeah. <laughs> toolbox. I mean, he literally did nothing. Fitch is out cold. And, and and I saw some people talking shit on the internet today. Like, oh, well, BJ Penn held the choke for, for five more seconds. And uh, somebody else, I can't remember who it was, rear naked chokes. You, If you fucking choke me, hold a real naked choke for five more seconds. This fucking choke? Anybody who's <laughs> ever done any jujitsu? Mm-hmm. That thing does fucking damage. It hurts, and a guy's unconscious, and you're squeezing his neck. All this shit right here, as hard as you can. You're a fucking idiot to think that, that a rear naked choke is the exact same as that front choke. Said that you brought That's him back fair. into the cage. What'd you say to him? Is this live? <laughs> yeah, okay. I said, are you out of your mind? What are you doing? <laughs> I just grabbed him in the hallway back there too. I just grabbed him and said, you know, what is your, and he said, I was, I, I was upset and disappointed. <laughs> I said, well, next time you're upset and disappointed about winning, do it in the back, okay? Stay in the octagon. What, it's like professional suicide. Professional suicide. You leave the octagon before the decision is called in the fight that you want. Do you, are you out of your mind? Who is that about? Who left the octagon before they when got he the goes hand limp, raised? He goes limp and he's out. Then he rolls him fucking over, lets his head fucking flop to the thing, and then stands up over him. He's literally like this, standing up over him before Mazagati even fucking gets in the picture. The Nevada State Athletic Commission is going to keep this fucking guy around until he seriously <laughs> hurts somebody. That guy is dangerous. Mm -hmm. That guy is dangerous. He's banned now, right? He got He's blacklisted. Dangerous. That is horrible. <laughs> that looks like something out of a Halloween movie. Oh, man. That is just bad. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Are his nipples supposed to be eyes? 100% this guy thinks he's a vampire. Who the Colin hell? Colin Fletcher? Yeah, I don't even know who That's that is. That's what I'm saying. Who the it's hell is that correct. guy? When you talk about the Nevada State Athletic Commission and the fact that they keep doing this, it's complete and total ego. I think it's just because you keep complaining, yes, they keep doing I keep it. complaining, they will keep putting him front and center. On a show like that has Which nothing to do with you. Disgusting! <laughs> it's disgusting. At what point do you realize that this guy's an incompetent fool? And he's going to hurt somebody. So, so what, I wonder what's going to happen when somebody gets seriously hurt in a Mazzagatti fight. What are they going to write it off to? You know, oh, you know, anything can happen. This is a, this is, this is a, 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 a combat sport. Yeah. Anything can happen. This guy is dangerous. They, that is exactly what they'd say, though. Oh, I wonder who's fighting. Come on, Ralph. Ralph, stop the fucking Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> and on the move, he's got lots of media to do a record-breaking night, uh, the fastest title fight in UFC history. What went through your mind when that happened? Holy <laughs> <shit>. <laughs> If a fighter feels comfortable with Steve Mazzagatti, if, let me tell you what, if I was a fighter, oh my God, he, is this and I, I showed up <laughs> that night and said Steve, I'd be like, Steve oh, Mazzagatti. fucking hell no. One of two things are going to happen tonight. I'm either going to get hurt or, uh, or this guy's going to do something stupid and screw up my fight. You know? <laughs> if you ever watch Mazzagatti ref a fight, he fucking stands there like this. <laughs> he is He's doing destroying his fucking this guy. Grocery list. 
thinking about what he what, did he TiVo the fucking uh, his favorite show. <laughs> I, I don't know what the fuck this guy's doing. Or sometimes he'll go like this and start looking like this when they're not even fucking doing anything. When they're doing <laughs> shit, he's not in there when he's supposed to be in there. Oh my god. Like, the guy has no fucking yeah. idea what he's looking at. I said it a long time ago. The guy shouldn't even be watching MMA on television, <laughs> let alone fucking reffing it. Oh my you know, god. He thinks, oh, he's, he just fucking hates this guy. I don't even know the guy. <laughs> he might be the nicest guy in the world. He might fucking, uh, on, his, on weekends, might save small orphans from fucking disasters, <laughs> for all I know. I don't know what the guy does. Dude. I don't know him at all. I know he should not be he, in a fucking Is he fucking, trying to be hilarious uh, right now? Because cage roughing he a fight. is. Here we go. Trying to keep the streak alive tonight. Oh, here we go. And the streak lives on. The streak lives on. We beat him again. I love this shit. Wow. I don't know that? how you walk into a tattoo shop and say, yeah, I'll take that one right there. Well, you got me on Who that Who is one. that, McGregor? I don't ever remember seeing that. Where the fuck is that? That's on his arm? Holy shit. Yeah, I've never noticed that. <laughs> he was a uh, boxing trainer, right? I'm Your pretty sure. He's always looking for me every morning. Now they came and found me. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Dana White was a boxing trainer. doesn't look too hot the problem, to be honest guy, doesn't look too good if you've never been in that fucking choke that, that john fitch was in well, he had his arms around his neck big deal yeah let somebody who's who's trained strong and has that choke on you the right way do it to you have him just do it to you for a second and yeah. see how you feel i'm not talking about choke you unconscious and then keep holding it until he wants to let go and you see fitch's arms go dead you see him go limp mm-hmm Mazzagotti's standing in the corner. <laughs> Pick up some bread, fucking milk, right? Then what's even? I mean, I probably shouldn't over. laugh at this because a guy's life was on the line. The like, flips his head back. Then when these reps don't like stop this. the fight, it is a Mazzagotti danger going, to the fighter. But is he sleeping? I he's just going over. in on this guy right now. I'm gonna kill myself. All right, well, that's all I have for this one. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, peace.